So, there's been an amazing response so far to this channel. This being only the fourth video, we've already gotten 100,000 subscribers. The whole reason we started this channel was for beer money. And today is the day, now that we've had some successes under our belt, that I get to go check with our accountant to see how much AdSense we've made. Let's go. How's it going? Oh, good, man. All right, you ready to see the numbers? All right. 735,000 views Woo! so far, 3.4 million minutes of watch time, over 130,000 subscribers. Woo! All right, and let's take a look at the revenue here. I can taste the beer right now. Looks like there might be a small error here. Uh, um, it says zero dollars, zero dollars. So, um, um, so you're saying there's no beer money yet? What I'm saying is you have a lot more stuff to chop before YouTube decides to monetize your channel. Okay, well, I guess we better get chopping then. Uh, comment below if you think YouTube should monetize these videos. Let's go. Hello and welcome back to the Guillotine Channel, your place for subscription-only, barely legal guillotine content. So today we are gonna be chopping a bunch of Nerf and X-Shot rifles. They've been sitting around our studio, they're all broken. So today, we're gonna put them under the guillotine and we're gonna see just how many it can get through at once. How better to send them off than to feed them to the guillotine? Now, to start off, we're gonna begin with just one simple dinky blaster. We're gonna see how it performs. I assume it'll go right through this thing, no problem. And then we're gonna move up to maybe three or four. If it does that, then I'm pretty confident that we can get through the whole pile. And it, it can very well get stuck on a few of these things. Yeah, I don't maybe. have the greatest confidence that it'll get through all of these, but you know what they say around here, Nick? What do they say, Jay? Drop until you chop. That is what they say. Let's put this guillotine to its limit. Let, let's let it crunch. Let crunch it until you munch, dude. <laughs> it's gonna go right through this, man. Now, the real question is, will it go through 15? Okay, Jake. Ready? I love that. Dude, you guys breaking our toys? <laughs> they don't work. Wow, did you see all the particles? Let's look at the replay on that. Ooh, that was good, man. <laughs> it's Dude, there's like into the abyss. a double yeah. crunch going on there. Let's get three in there. We can get crunchier than that. Right now, she's like, get serious, guys. Give me something I can, give me something that's a challenge. Do you think that anything's gonna get jammed in the rails and stop the blade? No. Probably not? No. Why would that happen here? That's never happened before, ever. Ever. <laughs> Yeah, cantaloupe husk. Cat. It didn't cut at all. I'm speeding. Okay, ready? Yeah. Three, two, one, drop her. Oh my gosh! That's such a clean cut. That's amazing. Yeah, they slid. That was the problem, is they slid. Slid. Now it's a pistol. Yeah, I think least. we're starting to learn that the placement of the item that you're chopping yeah. and the security of it Super important. It's like the most important. Yeah. Because the blade is at an angle, so you need to make sure that what you're chopping is, is secure. And it makes sense because a, a person's head would be pretty secure. We're going to need to make sure that the big batch doesn't move too much because that was a lot of motion. Well, as we say, drop until it chops. Three, two, one, dropper. Wow, the way that it flung those. Look at my face. Oh, dude, <laughs> wow. Whoa, dude. The, the fact that they were centered, that's the only way to get the bite, is so, to make sure that the item doesn't move in the middle. It's like there's nowhere for them to go. Yeah, look at how clean that is. You have a little impact right there, but then once it bites, it just I'm not sure why exactly, but it came close to derailing again that time. We definitely need to kind of go back to the drawing board on the rail system. Let's do the big batch. I don't know about this, Jake. There's no Nerf guns left in there. What are the odds that it gets through this? Be honest. I predict it's gonna do a lot of damage. One more team. Let's see if this works. Safety. Okay. Ready, Ready Jake? Destroy all extra. All right, three, two, one, drop it! Uh, 
You boys went off the rails again. We're going off the rails. <laughs> oh! I can't do it. I can't take it down and put it back up one more time. I can't do it. I won't do it. It took a chunk out of the mast. We get cocky every time. You could have freaking slept under that thing. Yeah. You wouldn't even have woken up. Well, you know, Nick, um, in a way, I think this was a success. I really wanted to see my chop. In the pursuit of excellence, you must find failure. And that's what we've done here today. Now, I think we should come back at this. That fight is going to happen another day. I can't do this. This is the perfect time to do it. If we can make 50 bucks a month on the guillotine channel, <laughs> that's our goal. That's our goal. That will pay for the beer. For the beer. For the beer. 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 Thank you. We couldn't leave it on that note because we drop until we chop around here. As you can see, we've restacked. We've got seven in here. The reduction in number. We're gonna see some some fireworks here. Rolling, rolling, rolling. This looks way more promising. Yeah. You know what the best thing about guillotines is? I keep getting older. They stay the same age. All right, Jake. All right. Let it rip. Ready? And three, two, one. I'm getting delirious here, guys. The guillotine madness is setting in! All right, Nick, are you ready? Pull them up real These quick. These last two think that they can fucking not die. Vive la France. Chop until you drop. Drip, drop, chop, drop. Rip it. You ready? Chop until you drop! <laughs> Okay, that was awesome. Did you see how far <laughs> into the air that flew? It flew like way, I think it hit the air conditioner. Here it goes, here it goes. <laughs> Look at that, Ooh. dude. They're just disappeared from the mm. table. Look at that one, it went right past me. Wow. Guys, every day is an adventure here at the Guillotine Channel. I think the coolest things that we can chop are things that are intricate, things that have lots of particles that are possible. So if you have any ideas of things that you'd like to see under the blade, let us know in a comment. If you wanna see the finest quality, guillotine content, consider subscribing.